is up everybody welcome to today's video and today I will be showing you guys how to create a cool game icon like you know one of these or something and it's actually pretty simple and it's just kind of like a little tutorial on you know how to make one so I'm gonna log into here and I'll be using Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Photoshop, I don't know how to say it. So I'm going to open up Snipping Tool. And I'm just going to select um, from here down to my arm. So you can do it as much as, as far down as you want. So before I copy and all that stuff, we need to go to um, Create. And then you go to Configure Start Place. Go down to thumbnails, well, game icon sign out thumbnails, and then you'll see something like this, alright? So, here's um, an icon tutorial. I just need to find out the size that I need for my icon 512 by 512. So, let's get that in. I'm gonna click new with 512 and 512. So basically just a square. Pretty simple. Now I'm gonna paste in my image from here. Here it is. And then here's the easy part. You can click this button right here. And boom. And just kind of zoom in and go through here. But if you don't have Adobe Photoshop, uh, you could probably try to find out a way to like there are ways to crop things and make things transparent with like free photo editors. But you kind of want to make this kind of quick and simple, so I'm not going to explain how to do that. Now I'm going to click this, move this around, and then hold Control and then T. So you can um, size. And then see this? It's on the top layer. I'm gonna hold it and move it under this one. So it looks like that. Right. I'm gonna go to my character and then double click the image go to outer glow and this one I may or may not do I'm just gonna see if it looks good right. I'm gonna go with that so I'm gonna take this Move that about right there. Double click this again a whole bunch of times. I don't know why. I don't know how it really works. What is it doing? Okay, there we go. There we go. So I'm gonna click stroke and then right here it'll do like an outline. So you can do like rainbow if you click a, a gradient one right here. Click gradient. Either like rainbow or something, or no, am I gonna do? So I'm gonna take this thing and then go around. Here. Make sure you have your background selected for this. And then go all the way around it. Alright, and then Control J. So that just copy pasted it, but only that area that I selected it. 
So now I can delete this. And then now I just have this. And I can go inside. Look at that. That looks pretty cool. So I'm gonna go with that right there. I'm gonna do save as, and then kind of whatever your, um, whatever you use in here, which I use PNG. So I'm gonna save it into my GFX folder, because it's kind of a GFX, so. Game thumbnail icon. Alright. Then we're gonna click save. Okay. Now I'm gonna go. And then I'm gonna go over here to create. And then I'm gonna go to group creations. Or just find your game that you want to edit the thumbnail on. And then go to create. Configure start place. Sorry. Go to configure start place, game icon, and then choose a new file. Here's it. Alright. And then I'm going to click upload image. Add icon. You sure you want to have this icon to so delete your ex existing icon? Click yes. And then save. And then after a little bit, your image will process through, it'll get approved by Roblox if it's appropriate. And yeah, that's basically how you do it. That is how you create a, um, a Roblox thumbnail. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye.